Oh man, we're gonna teach him this time. Oh, hey, 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 remember me? Yeah, you know, the guy who, it was too dangerous for me to go out this way? Yeah, well, look now, I'm on a skarmory. Yeah, what you guys say about that, huh? Do you have a skarmory? No, you don't have a skarmory, do you? You don't have a skarmory, you don't have coffee, you don't have any friends, and yeah, I am just, oh my god, you are just so freaking jealous right now, aren't you? Oh my god, why won't you talk to me? What do I have to do to get your attention? Why, why won't you love me? <laughs> Scarberry, I just don't know what I'm gonna do to get his attention. I just want to... I just don't know what to do. I love him so much. He doesn't even know I exist. He just wanted to defend me and I yelled at him and I lost it forever. Uh, ooh, who are you? Hi, you want to be my friend? What's going on guys, here with Hardy Tag, welcome back to Pokemon Light Platinum, the Nuzlocke run. In the last episode, we learned how to fly on a Skarmory because we're super freaking awesome, and today we're going to be going north because we can. And I don't I don't have any reason for going north, we're just going to be doing it. I don't remember if we caught a Pokemon here, but I think we found something and then we killed it, so my bad. But anyways, we're going to be taking on this trainer. I believe we have to go north and that's where the next gym will be. I'm not 100% sure, so don't like quote me on that, I guess we'll just, we'll find out as time goes by, but um, I have a good feeling about the north path. I don't know why, for some reason when I just, I look at north, I just think, this is where I'm supposed to be in life. This, this isn't gonna mislead me. Always go north, children. Why do you think they call it the North Star? Yeah, because that's where you're supposed to go. That's where they want you to go. And you're, are you really, are we, are we really gonna do this? Huh, you really just, you're gonna recover all day? Is that, is that, is that all you're gonna do? Oh, oh, so you can do it again, that's so awesome. But I got a Shadow Ball, now you're dead, how's that feel? Yeah, not very good, does it? Not very good, is it? Yeah. Not much you can do about it. Now you're just there, being all dead. You would use Light Screen, okay, well, I'll just Shadow Ball you. And then your Light Screen doesn't do anything, does it? Wow, and I'm gonna finish you off with a Crunch. I use three different, I don't, I don't know how it's relevant that I use three different moves on him. I just wanted to point out because I thought maybe it was an interesting factoid. And now you guys are trying to tell me that it isn't. It's just like, wow, why is it got to be like that? I just don't understand why you guys are trying to make my life so confusing. It's just, ah. Okay, so I don't really, I just kind of like starting to realize I don't have anything to talk about. Because there's like nothing interesting going on in this Let's Play right now besides the fact that we're confused. So, oh, oh, okay. Actually, I do have something to talk about because I've been meaning to talk about this and I kept forgetting. So today I don't want to forget it. I actually want to get the topic out there and out of the way. So... Some of you might know about my Pokemon Coliseum Let's Play. It's, um, okay, so apparently we can't go this way. We can't go north. You know, remember that whole thing about following north? Um, just never go north. It's a lie. The north is a lie. Um, anyways, so Pokemon Coliseum. I originally started off as a Let's Play. Now it is a Nuzlocke, or it, then it became a Nuzlocke, and now I have no idea what it is now. So I've actually decided I'm going to leave that up to you guys because it appears, it appears to be like really split right down the middle on what I should be doing it as, whether I should restart it as a Nuzlocke or just continue as a Let's Play or whatever. So I'm going to let you guys tell me. So since for some reason lately I've become like completely infatuated with doing polls, there's going to be a poll in the description. So I want you guys to click that link and go vote for me, okay? And I want you guys to tell me, should Pokemon Life or should Pokemon Coliseum continue as a normal Let's Play or should I restart it as a Nuzlocke? You guys tell me. Just go down in the description. Have your voice heard on when you guys affect the future of my channel. So please don't mislead me or choose something stupid, even though there's only two options and none of them are stupid. I'm still trusting you guys. This is like the biggest decision of my life here. And I'm letting you guys have a major, major, major part of it. Please don't let me down, okay? Okay, I'm going to need some kind of recognition here that you guys understand. Just, just send me... I'll give you guys my address. I want you to just send me a piece of paper with a smiley face drawn on it. That's what you guys' mission is for today. That's all you got to do. And if you... Oh my god. Okay, here we go again. If you don't have a Tentacruel, I'm going to question all of your logic. Because you were literally sitting on top of a Tentacruel. The last guy had a Whalmer. He's cool. If you don't have a Tentacruel... Oh my god. You, you ha you're sitting... On the tentacle. I don't want to battle these stupid trainers. I don't like water type Pokemon. And I. Oh, okay, I like water type Pokemon. I take that back. What is TM19? I'm gonna guess. Rain Dance. 
Uh, Giga Drain. Ooh, that's like completely useless. Cause the only Pokemon that can learn it already learns it. Yay, I'm so glad they gave me that move then. Um, anyways, now we're out of the water. So yay. Um, oh, hey, hi. Kosaka City is a rustic town with a tower just down the road. Okay. I didn't even ask you about this town. You just, what the, what the heck is that? Is that a, I think it's a Stunky. Oh, okay, it is a Stunky. Wow, that, that is like the ugliest Pokemon. I've ever seen, but um, ooh, we got a tower and a gym. Uh, what kind of gym is this? I can't really tell by looking at the town. Coastal City Gym, Lucy, Fighting Type. Ooh, okay. Um, well, it looks like we're gonna be taking on the third gym already in like the second episode of the Warren League. So I'm gonna guess. I think what today is like part 26. I'm gonna guess this series will probably be done with the Warren League by like part 30. Um, oh, what the heck? Hello, trainer. I'm Lucy, the leader of this gym. Sorry, but I have to leave the gym for- Wow, big freaking surprise. You have to leave the gym. Some people dressed in white enter the Sky Tower, and it's my job to stop them. How is that your job, huh? Is that, like, on the resume for when you become a gym trainer? Is- Oh, you have to do freaking become a superhero. No, you shouldn't have to- You're not a superhero. This- This place looks awful. Oh, hey, coffee, that's you. Hey. Hey, Coffee, there's two of you. What do you think about that, huh? You're famous. How does that feel? I bet it feels pretty awesome, huh? Oh, great. So we got a bunch of Team Steam problems again. I thought we got rid of these guys in the last region, but apparently not. So we're going to have to do this all over again where we have to go in. We have to beat them up because they obviously can't stop us. Despite the fact that we already beat their, like, may, may, we literally left the head of this organization in the distortion world. And Team Steam hasn't given up yet. At least Team Galactic, I had to think about that for a second. I always get Galactic and Plasma confused, but at least Team Galactic just like gave up when you ditched their leader into the distortion world. But no, you guys, you just won't take a hint. And I gotta admit, I really think that's very inappropriate to you guys, that you guys are being so inappropriate. You're just being so immature about this situation. And I just, I don't think, what it, how is that taking care of business? You're, Okay, she's all like, oh, I gotta go take care of this, these people. And you're standing there making me do everything. Just why? Oh, Psychic. Heck yeah, we'll get rid of Psybeam. Um, Dusclops is coming up. Let's use... Ah, dang, I can't use Koopa yet. I want to use Koopa, but it's, she's just... it. He's... I don't know. I think Koopa's a guy because someone's like, one does not easily go from guy to girl like when Gar when Curly evolved I'm like Curly is all grown up he's a woman now and someone in the comments like Curly is a boy okay aren't you supposed to be like taking okay you're going really fast this is really weird stop I'm running training and defeating all the team team members that I can all this you you're you're not defeating anybody what what no just you uh, my god why are they so useless in this game their only purpose in this game is to die that would be fantastic if you could actually like murder people in this game. I would love that because I would murder everybody in this game because they all deserve. Well, not everybody deserves the guy. Like I don't think, I don't think this team Steam guy. He didn't do anything wrong. He's probably just trying to do his job, and I'm here mocking him. And yeah, I forgive him. He's cool. Okay, him and me, we're gonna meet up for lunch after I record, and it's gonna be awesome. But like the rest of the people, like all the freaking gym leaders, they all deserve to die. This is really stupid. This is really, really freaking stupid. Why am I not switching out? Oh my god. <laughs> Quinn, you would have so died there. And I just, I didn't care. Just take down Miss twice. That's awesome. Okay. Well, happy face. And wow, we're already at the top. That was quick. Oh my god, Rayquaza. What? Wait, have we encountered, we haven't encountered any Pokemon in this place. We can catch this Rayquaza. You again. We're going, to, wait. Who did I leave in a distortion world? I'm confused now. We're going to catch Rayquaza no matter what you do. Okay, so he has epic cool boss music and like Giratina just had the regular music. How does that make sense? Oh my god, he has an Altaria and it's such a high level. And, oh, Pear Song. Interesting, so you're going to force me to switch out. I still wish you were higher levels. It's not, f oh, okay, maybe, maybe not. Um, <coughs> Dragon Claw, I'm faster this time. Is it really a speed time? Unless you're using a negative priority move. That's all I could think of, but, um, huh, that's weird. Dustnor is up next. I want to get out because of Parish Song, so let's... Um... Let's go with Naro. He seems like he'd be fun. And Dustnor... Oh, I forgot Dustnor had Crunch. Wow. I was just sending him in because, like, you know, YOLO, why not? Oh my god, what did I just... 
did I, did I just say that? Did I? Oh my god. Just, I can't believe I said it. I am so sorry, guys. I swear it just, it slipped out. It wasn't meant to happen. It wasn't meant to turn out this way. I never meant to be one of those people. And I just, I didn't have control over the situation. I really, if I could have, I would have made it go differently. And I, I swear it'll never happen again. I am so sorry. I, I really, really am. And we're burned. I, you guys just burned me, didn't you? You left some rude comments and now I'm burned. And wow, okay, I didn't think Dragon Claw would do that much. Um, as long as Salamence doesn't have a Dragon type move, we should be fine. Salamence has a Dragon type move. Oh crap. Coffee? 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 Oh my god, coffee! What the heck? You took that? What? <laughs> no way! <laughs> Dude, you're awesome! Wow! Okay, cool! Um, yeah, awesome! God, you make me angry! <laughs> that's, that's probably the best, like, ending dialogue for battle I've ever seen. Just, oh, you make me really angry, kid. <laughs> You keep trying to destroy Team Steam, but this time we have a chance. I'll catch Rayquaza. Team Steam will survive. You don't have a chance in hell. Wow, that was rude. Garchomp, use Dragon Claw. Oh my god. Did he just eat them? Oh my god. That looks more like a good bite than a Garchomp. Just saying. This team of scumbags have been trying to warm their way into Lauren ever since they lost in Ziri. I'm Blake, Lauren's champion, and I'll deal with the last, last, what's left of Team Steam. Rayquaza is just chilling here. He's like, okay, guys, I'll just, I'll be going now. You obviously don't need me here. Um, now that Rayquaza's gone, I'll get back to work. Whoa, what, what, what? Just, what? <laughs> I'm so confused. Okay, now, what are you just doing chilling here? This temple is very important to people here. It's where our city was, your city was born from a, a temple. What the heck? Oh my god, you battle me too? What? No, no, just, just let me go home. I don't want to battle you anymore. I didn't heal coffee, and I'm just, it's a very bad time for me right now. Okay, you know, it's that time of the month. I just kind of want to go home and take care of it, but no, you insist on having to battle me. Okay, let's heal up Giratina. My god, we almost lost Giratina. I'm just like, oh my god, this game's so easy. Giratina's like, bro, don't, don't say that, please. Just don't say that. I don't want to die. I apologize, Giratina. I won't let you die anymore. I will never, ever let Giratina die. I will put Giratina in a box before I let Giratina die. Which, oddly, coincidentally, when someone dies, you often put them in a box. So, it's a little contradicting, isn't it? But anyways, I believe we'll be able to go take on the gym now. And you know what? This seems like a perfect chance to tear up Quinn. Because I'm just that dumb. I'm going to... Oh my god, are you serious, Silver? What the heck? Finally, I found you again. Time for another... Man, we're never going to get in this gym, are we? This is ridiculous. Alright, whatever. You have a... Okay, you have a Charizard. Wasn't expecting that. Um, let's switch it to orange, because that was terrifying. I almost... Oh, oh my god, he has Dragon Rage, guys. Look out. He is Dragon Rage. Oh my god. Just gotta go hide. I'm freaking scared of that. Okay, for Agron, uh, let's go with Nora. Well, Nora's like the only one that hasn't reached 71 yet. And after this battle, he will be 71, because he's my... And then we're gonna fly on him, because he's just a big flying earth turtle. Oh my god, he's so big. Wow, okay, I was all bragging about how we're going to level up, and he's just like, <laughs> No. No, you're not. That's funny. We will level up. We can do this. Uh, how did we only get 300 XP from killing an Aggron? Yo, I've noticed that was really weird. When I was grinding, that Aron gave off more experience than Lyron. And apparently Lyron gives off more experience than Aggron. I don't think it's supposed to be that way, so that's really weird. And I'm not going to question it because it's Poke Logic and it's probably just some weird thing in White Platinum. It's probably some glitch, but yeah, it's it's kind of scaring me. Thanks for the diversion, but I've got the badges to earn. Okay, that's that's cool. See, yeah, I don't even know what to say to you. It kind of scares me. Anyways, let's get on with this gym. Looks like we can actually challenge it now, which is surprising. I was figuring, oh, we're going to walk out again and we're just going to get destroyed for like a third freaking time. But nope, reversal, this is, okay, I got to remember, reversal is not what I think it is. Now it's going to do a ton of damage, so I'll just quick attack you instead. Oh my god, guys. I'm so smart. I, I'm i just the smartest Pokemon trainer. I should get a cookie. That'd be awesome. And I have Detect, too. We should have just, like, detected each other. Mega Punch. Oh. Uh. Oh my god. I'm going to Detect you. Next time you do that, we're just going to Detect each other. And it's just going to be like a big Detect Fest. Okay, Koopa, this is your time to shine. I swear, if you die in your very first battle, we're going to have major issues. Please one-shot this thing. 
Please? Oh my god, no. Oh my god, it's staring at us. It's a stalker. It's a st Oh, you're faster now. Oh, okay, yeah. You <laughs> you scary face. Like, why are you all of a sudden faster? What the heck? Man, apparently I just completely ignored the last turn of this game. So, let's sidekick again. Hopefully... Ah! scary oh you scary face again wow really you couldn't just freaking finish me off you had a scary face again I could have stayed in and killed you but no you you ruined that moment for me we were gonna have something special and you took that away from me I don't understand why it has to be like that I just want a straight-out answer why were you being so mean to me is it something I said or did? Is it like the way I acted or treated you? Because I apologize. I promise we could work this out. Wait, what am I even talking about? I'm really confused now. I think I'm just going to pretend that this whole day never happened. Um, I don't know. This is, is it just me or does this gym look really familiar to another gym in another Pokemon game? I'm just, except, you know, without any actual puzzle. This... Because this isn't exactly difficult. But, oh, I never went to the Pokemon Center and healed Coffee. I am sorry, Coffee. You know what? I will... Here, you could be up front. Because you're that awesome. I'll even let you battle these guys while you're burned. Because that's obviously a good idea. And I trust you. So, but I'll just use... I use special type moves because... Your physical attack is, like, cut and all that. So it doesn't... If you use Detect, I swear. Oh my god, Hitmon Top! You're the... Yes, you're my favorite of the Hitmons... Because you look so freaking adorable and you spin on your head and it's cute and awesome. But that doesn't give you the right to just detect everything I do. It's very rude and I don't appreciate it. And I think we need to have like a serious conversation about our feelings. Okay? Because if you keep acting like that, you may no longer be my favorite. I'm, just, I'm not trying to be rude here. I'm just trying to state an obvious fact that you're taking the situation way out of control I really should have used shadow ball even though I'm burned so it probably would have done that much but I'm just trying it out useless to stay oh my god another hit my top okay you know what you're gonna kill by Quinn this time yeah how's it feel you're gonna kill by the wimpy little bird who's like 15 levels lower than you and it one shot at you how does it feel huh how does it feel probably doesn't feel too good huh I bet you're a little sad right now aren't you Oh, use high- Oh, I was gonna say, use high jump kick. That'd be adorable, but no. Freaking use- fo What did you use? I don't remember what he used, actually. I wasn't paying attention. Um, focus energy or something like that? But whatever, we're finally at the gym. Ooh, she has a match yap. Um, do I have anything to get this burn off? Do I have burn heals? I have 21 ice heals for some reason. And all I have is full heals. Okay, whatever. And let's go take on the fighting type gym leader. I think her name is Lucy. Yeah. Alright, let's do it. Welcome to the Kosaka City Gym. I'm the leader here, and I use the power of fighting Pokemon to battle. You know the worst part? That was actually like the best gym leader dialogue in this entire game. The rest of them are just like, oh, battle me. And this one's actually like, hey, I'm going to talk to you for a second because I can, and it's cool. So I'm going to try to do this with coffee because I want to, um, this seems like it, it could be a good idea. So this time with Shadow Ball, that way next time Dragon Ball will kill you. Oh, Okay. Wow, that was actually kind of smart. My reader didn't hypnosis. I have a feeling... Actually, I don't think he gets Dream Eater. Okay, he has Water Gun, guys. Watch out. He has Water Gun. Oh, my God. What are we going to do? He has Water... Uh, I wasn't prepared for this. Oh, okay. We'll just superpower you. I don't think superpower is going to one-shot Lucario. Superpower hasn't seemed to one-shot anything for some reason. So... Yep, oh my god, I predicted that. Okay, and now we will Dragon Call you to... Okay, we won't Dragon Call you. We'll Shadow Ball you to finish you off. Are you going to use... You had a perfect chance to kill me. Do you have any idea how low my defense is right now? Although, admittedly, probably the only physical moves you have are fighting types, which I'm immune to because I'm awesome. But, um... Oh, god, I want to... I want to... Uh, okay, so I was going to say I want to be a stupid and, like, send in Quinn, but that seemed wrong. That seemed stupid on, like, every level, so... Well, just superpower, because that's obviously a good idea, having, like, minus six defense. Okay, I just realized, like, how well my physical defense is, but I don't think he'll have any moves that can hit me, unless he has foresight. Then I might be in trouble. But we'll just keep this up, and we'll use Shadow Ball, and we will beat him. Yeah, you know, I don't think he has anything that can hit me. 
That's awesome. So we can literally just sit here and troll him forever. This is probably like the worst way to kill somebody because I feel super bad right now. Oh, you have cross chop. That's so awesome because it would totally one shot me if that hit me, but it doesn't. So I can just laugh at you instead and now I'm just going to crunch you. Oh, he has dynamic punch too. It's a shame. Usually like a lot of match jokes have foresight, but you must not get it. Or you must have probably lost it to dynamic punch, I'm assuming. I bet you wish you still had it right now. Your attacks are very quick and effective. You earned a force badge really quick and effective because I seem to remember using a lot of crunch, which is not very effective, and I was extremely slow. So, I don't think you're paying much attention, ma'am. You earned a force badge. Lucy, use the force. With the force badge, you can use Ice Smash outside of battle to crush small blocks of ice. Why did my voice just change mid-sentence? Because I just realized I'm still a girl. This TM continues Ice Smash. With it, you can destroy any chunks of ice to block your path. Which is also a brand new move in this game, so... I wasn't paying attention to what number that is, so I gotta go find it. And then we'll teach us... There it is, Ice Smash. Um, it is a fighting type move. Cluckers can learn it, which... Um, what is the base power of this? It better not just be like Rock Smash. Ooh, 80. Okay, so it's... Five less than Sky Uppercut, it has the same amount of BP, but it has 100% accuracy. Um, oh, is this just Brick Break? Or is Brick Break always 80 base power? I don't remember. Either way, um, we'll get rid of Sky Uppercut, because that's I definitely would prefer that. I'll give up the five base power for 100% accuracy, and it's a TM, and we'll need it to progress the game. And I gotta, I just, one sec, I gotta pause really quick. Okay, so it's like raining really bad today, which completely surprised me because I don't think anybody was expecting it to rain. And that's kind of causing my allergies to um, start acting up, which I was like really glad when spring is over because then like my allergies went away. And now they're coming back because it's all the rain. So it's like, yay, I'm so happy right now. Anyways, I don't even know if this is the way I'm supposed to be going, but oh my god, trainers. No, I don't want to battle you. I'm just going to go this way. This seems like a much safer path because this has a ledge. Wow, wait, was I really just able to s skip all that? Oh, okay. That's oh, phone. Stop. Oh, uh, no, I don't want to... I don't want to... Oh, my God, red grass. Okay, you know what? I'll battle you for that red grass. This oh, my God, cool. I want to... I want... No, I want to touch the red grass, Mommy. I want to touch it. Is it like... <gasps> oh, my God. I don't know what... Phone, knock it off. I'm trying to do a video. Um, anyways, you think someday I'll learn to put my phone on silent, but that's just way too much effort. Um, I don't know why I think, talking about red grass, it made me think of, like, what if they made spicy marijuana? And then that made me think, like, the other day, me and Rusty were talking, and we had decided that they, sh that McDonald's should sell, should sell pot chicken nuggets. So, if you guys were at McDonald's, would you buy... You're not a caterpillar. So, would you guys buy pot chicken nuggets or not? Tell me down in the description, the comments below. I think that'd be really awesome to know. Um, imagine like pot. Well, I've never um, tried marijuana before or any kind of drugs. I've never even been like fully drunk before, just like fake drunk where I it was a little buzzed because I drank moonshine and Pepsi. And that was a horrible day. Anyways, um, yeah, pot chicken nuggets, you guys tell me below. Anyways, next time we'll be exploring more of this forest because I just, I'm starting to, I, I think I'm running out of things to talk about. So we'll just end it here. If you guys enjoyed the video, how about maybe, um, 5 million likes. Or just, actually, if you just enjoyed the video, how about you like it, okay? We don't, we're not going to have put a certain goal on it because that's putting pressure on you guys and you don't deserve that. So until next time, I'm Hardy Tech Yo-Yo. Peace! That means bye!